Hey everyone, welcome back to another episode of The Binding of Isaac Afterbirth Plus. We are due for a greedier mode after a nice respite doing the uh, the beans challenge last time. So let's let's not beat around the bush. We gotta get Maggie done. Haven't even done regular greed mode as Maggers here. Let's see if we can get it done. NQZ84X7Y is our seed. Starting off with the bombastic, fantastic mom's lipstick and some spiders glorious okay so we'll pop that uh you know there's something to be said for what we got going on here i will play this man right away because i would like to have the advantages sooner rather than later and by advantages i mean what is this trash Okay, so we just gotta start cracking. Not much we can do so far. Now, Maggie's at a little bit of a disadvantage because I haven't unlocked the, um... There is the one challenge we could do where Maggie always starts with a speed up pill. If I'm gonna be doing challenges, I probably should target that one next. It does make Maggie a lot more, um sustainable you know a lot a lot more palatable in the early game as a character because you're not just suffering from that uh, annoying speed handicap i will use the yum heart yum heart's not great but it may be able to help us if we do take some damage here in the very early game because our 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 own damage sucks and we can't get through the waves fast enough and we get like sort of overwhelmed by enemies occasionally here which could happen very easily I hate this, but we should be able to just kite. There we go. Kind of satisfying, blowing up that cluster all at once, and... We actually got back to good here, back to like uh, a net zero. Anybody remember the net zero of the internet provider? Probably nobody in my audience is as old as me. <laughs> Which is saying something about me and about you. And about who I am. And I don't want to think about it, okay? I don't want to think about it. I'm still a young man. And I know what love is. Okay, so we got through this. I think this is our last wave. And in fact, I know it because the button has been grayed out. And because it's greedier mode, we only have 12 cents. We're not interested in any of these items. We are interested in grabbing a key. You know, you might as well do this. Sometimes there's a coin behind those blocks. That is a zero sum, so that's fine. I'm not going to gamble on an iron chest. I think an iron chest could bone us. And we're going to say no. I will take Monstro's Lung. A Monstro's Lung early, we can maybe try to build around it. And hope that it's not too much of a detriment and instead is a boon. But it is a little bit, it's a weird one, you know? It's not my favorite of the, uh, like, quote-unquote, strong items in Isaac. It's, like, a riskier one, for sure. But overall, I still think it's good. We dodge, what, four times? Yeah, four times. I would like you to be dead now. Thank you. Not having that guy while we're fighting, uh... The Duke of Flies here is very nice. Because this makes this so much easier. Ow, really? Do me like that. Oh wow. And I used I used Yumart as I was taking another hit of damage. Classic. Classic maneuver. You wouldn't understand it. Alright. Manage to take out the man himself. Clean up the riffraff. I do think we just fight. Focus on one, and since the horse was who we shot at first, that's who we focused on. You know, I mean, I was trash talking monsters long a little bit here. That was very good damage right there. Give me a good devil deal for once. For once in your gull darn lives greedier mode. Help me. <laughs> Up one. Health down! How dare you. And speed up. Okay, well, I mean, some is forgiven. Not all, but some 
of what just happened is forgiven. I don't think. All right, here's what we're gonna do. We are gonna take this. I'm gonna, I'm gonna be a little silly. We're gonna take that exclusively so that we can open this, which gave us another speed up pill. Okay. Well, you know, I thought the iron chest maybe would also have more in it because of mom's key. Didn't work out that way. I feel like a dang fool now, but this is the run. This is the bed I've made. And I'm snuggling up all cozy. We're going to sleep in it. Marked. Oh my god. Okay, Mark does nothing except improve our tier rate with Monstro's Lung. I feel great about it. And... We got Torn Photo, which will help our range a little bit. All right, we got a stew going here. Let's, ooh, a bomb would be very useful if you could hook me up. But first, let's like be extremely reckless. Okay, okay. Syringe is nice. I'm coming in. Give me a... Explosive diarrhea? Son of a bitch. All right, well, I mean, full health is nice there, but I would really love to have a bomb. We don't have one. So, and we're unlikely to be able to get one in any way unless we get some kind of uh, bomb producing item of some sort. Which is unlikely because I probably just won't buy anything on this floor because we have blind items. By the way, somebody lamented the fact that I did not take a uh, black candle even though I was complaining about a curse of the blind in greed mode. I don't think black candle is worth it. I, you know, the way you get rid of the curse of the blind in greed mode, in my opinion, you just go to the next floor. It's very unlikely that you're going to have curse of the blind every floor and black candle does not have much value. None of the other curses in greed mode matter Hardly at all. And uh, the only one that does matter is Curse of the Blind. Black Candle essentially is like, hey, like, yeah, if you get Curse of the Blind, it could help you, which is not a big deal, and you get a black card. It's not, it's not nearly as valuable as it is on a normal run. On a normal run, Black Candle is great. You know, saving you from Curse of the Maze, saving you from Curse of the Unknown, saving you from Curse of the Lost. Greedier mode where you got these short floors where you usually... It's a lot easier to keep track of what your HP is, all that kind of stuff. Like, Black Candle to me is is a, a pretty trash tier item, honestly, in greedier. In greed and greedier modes. You can feel free to disagree. But I, I'm not a fan. I will leave for a second and look here. Just in case the Devil Deal decides to actually be good, let's do this. Oh, and it's an Angel Deal, of course. Of course, why would it not be? Okay, well, let's see if we can do this. At least to get something out of this. That's a, that's a good sneak right there, we got it done. But the game continues to troll. So HP is looking fine. Damage is honestly looking fine for now. Damage is not looking like end game damage. We will take a syringe because we have one already. We got better tier rate and better damage. We got better everything except shot speed. So as far as I'm concerned, that's a 10 out of 10 experimental treatment, 100%. I also uh, saw some people saying that I lamented not having HP and didn't take HP. Here on greedier mode as well. Tears down. That's annoying. Luck up. That's not really that good. Um, I don't really... I don't take HP in greed mode unless it comes along with another advantage. You know what? Let's, let's have some fun with this for a second. Um, I will take... I will not take any keys because we're going to try to reroll to better items here. I think... I think in greed mode you don't want to take HP... Unless it comes along with like tears, unless it comes along with damage, etc., etc. That's my opinion on the matter. The the money is too precious to be spending on HP upgrades alone. Even if it is something like uh, you know raw liver, 
You maybe if you're if you're near the end of the game, you might buy a raw liver. You might, of course, buy like the soul or something like that. Especially if you need to be in, uh, you know, no red health territory. Just waiting for a uh, crop of enemies that I thought it was worthwhile to use uh, the anarchist cookbook against here, and that was this was the one. Okay, great shot. Good stuff. Okay. The splood shots, man. Sometimes they get me. And not in like a you complete me kind of get me way. Let's keep this. Um, you know, we got money. Why not? My god. I don't think this is any good with uh, Monster's Lung. And we, we already went off about Black Candles. I don't need to tell you how I feel about that. X-Ray Vision is like sem somewhat interesting. I don't think we want Pandora's Box. I will take a Jesus Juice mostly because it's cheap. And then we will just leave. And be very disappointed in the way this floor and this run continue to turn out. Need to be saved by a miraculous deal with the devil slash angel, please. Do we want to reroll again? I think we do. I will take this. It's, it might be too little too late, but we're going to take it. Ace of hearts. Why not? No soul hearts or anything? Okay. That's fine. Next opportunity, please. A little bit of money. Can't argue with that. Obviously, any, any money that we can get, we're happy to see it. On a greed or greedier. You know, I don't. I won't say that I always have the perfect uh, greed and greedier mode philosophies. There are times when I've uh, definitely made mistakes. Hive mind recently comes to mind, but <clears throat> I feel pretty confident in my decision making overall. So this is trash. If you're talking about what we can find in the angel pool versus what we did find, um, but I will take a cube of meat, I suppose, and I will. Try to be thankful. Down we go. Not holding out hope. I mean, we need like a lot more damage. A lot more DPS is maybe more to the point. Sure. You know, when you don't have the... Uh, when you don't have the, the personnel, you know, the, to have like a good squad on your team... You gotta, you gotta bring in a wild card. You gotta bring in the guy who's streaky, and that's that's 404 for us. What would help us out here? Another syringe would help us out a great deal. Um, I don't think. I think we buy a key, and then we come this way. Wow. Okay. I mean, it's interesting. It blocks shots. It smashes rocks. It doesn't afraid of anything, but I, yeah, I don't know. I think we're uh, I think we're sunk on this one. It's not looking great. Might be another another Maggie loss in the books. I'm guessing. We'll see. You know, I, I'm never one to just give up hope utterly. You know. Like when a cow goes to the you know the slaughter, he utterly utterly gives up hope, but. <sighs> this one, I'm worried. I'm pessimistic. Which is unlike, unlike me in gaming, more like me in real life. Tend to be a pretty hopeful gamer. Okay. I think we got through all the riffraff there, back to good.
Ah, that was just some silly damage. Okay, and then more damage after that is not a good place to be. Let's take a look. <sighs> Gave us a small tears up and a soul heart. Is that worth it? I don't know, dude. I knew it was HP and tears. I think we were we were closer to the Monstro's Lung tier cap than I thought. I'm still happy that we got there. Get the hearts while you can. Take them out. Now it's your turn. Nice. We can knock the Carrion Queen back pretty easily here. There we go. And then I think we just roll straight into the Devil Deal fight. We got, what, double Mr. Fred? That should be no problem. It is double Mr. Fred. Not a care in the world here on this one. Just watch out. The minions are maybe the only thing that could get to you here. Just because they might throw you off a little bit. So try to take them out when you can, as quickly as you can. Now we'll get on the same angle trajectory here. Just don't step on the creep. Or you'll make your mother... Don't finish that. Don't finish that. Sleep is obviously what I was going to say. Alright, devil deal. I deserve it! Okay. We've had one book, I think. But, I think I want to take both here. And I'll tell you my reasoning. I want to take both. Because... Yumheart is not going to do much for us. And... Curse, or not curse... Book of Sin might provide us with a bunch of HP through the next couple of floors. There is Spun. There's a chance. Along with Spun comes a chance. I'm excited is trash. Uh, we'll take a full card with us. We'll take this. Pop it. Can't do anything with that. I will take Rotten Baby. And obviously, we're worried about our chances here. We're worried about dying. But we're going to try to see if we can make something glorious still come out of this run. Do I want Coat Hanger? No. Do I want to hit up this Tinted Rock? Hells to the yeah. Two Soul Hearts is the best payout we could have asked for. I don't know, dude. I don't know about this one. Chemical Peel. It's damage. Placenta. HP. You know, HP of any flavor I'll take at this point. I don't think we want Either of these. I think we'll come in here. Alright, we can come back in here and get HP if we do not have a red heart. So now I'm real mad that we took placenta, but how could I possibly have known? I mean, I could have known, I guess, by going into the curse room first, but that seems like a crazy contingency to, like, plan for on purpose. So forgive me for not, like, being mad at myself for... Not thinking of that contingency. Please. Stop this! I'm excited, why must you do this to me? No! Stop it! Get out of here! Give me something. I need something. You know what, Hanged Man? It'll help. We could full card, like, the fuck out of here if we want to, but... It's pride now. I see pride, I see power. I see a badass mother who don't take no shit from nobody. <laughs> oh god, I'm alive. I'm alive. 
I knew I would be the whole time. Okay, well. I don't think we take those. I do think we take this. That's four soul hearts. And I do think we want synth oil if we can get it, which we we might be able to. I hate you. One's dead. That's nice. We should be able to do this. In a room like this size, if I take damage, it's entirely my fault. I need you to be dead, though. Okay. Now, where's the freaking horse at? There we go. You should go down quickly. Rotten baby, if you could send your dang flies to attack this boss. That would be, like, reasonable, I think. A reasonable request. Try not to ask for too much. It's only a 0.87 damage up. So I don't know that that actually was the right call. Scary. No, there's another freaking dark one and he almost lasered me. Got out of there by the hair on my chinny chin chin. And I'm Maggie. Ooh, that was scary. Okay, um... We want this, not because it's good, but because it enables the bed. That's only going to be a two soul heart, like, swing. There, but that's fine. Ah, give me something, you jerks. We should have full carded out of the curse room. What am I doing, by the way? We got keys. Although there's no item room on the next floor anyway. So if we could use them here, we should. You never know. You get a dime from a pot or something. Could make something glorious happen. This is, this is the... This is how far we've fallen. <laughs> Every day we stray further from God's light. Okay. Okay. Where would I peg our chances of beating greed? Like 28%, I think. Something like that. I think champion belt is probably the play. I mean, it doesn't even really help us, but we'll take it. I will come in here. We will full card out. The fool. Yeah, I think we go for champion belt. We're really just looking for the win as Maggie. I'm not worried about racking up anything in our donation machine, because I'm not sure we can even get the win. So I'm focusing on that instead of uh, getting getting too much hubris going here, thinking like, "Oh, we got it. Let's try to save our money." No, we definitely do not have it here. I don't even really know what it is, but this run ain't got it. Black heart is nice. I definitely probably. Haven't been popping uh, Book of Sin at times, but you, you can forgive me. We got to focus on staying alive. As priority numero uno. Okay, a card could be huge. Could be actually huge for the greedier fight. It also could be horrible. It's not, it's neither. <laughs> it's like, acceptable. The question is, is Champion Belt even good enough? Was there a reroll machine? I don't remember. If there's a reroll machine, the question is like, should we reroll Champion Belt to try to get something even better? I think the answer might be yes. 
This is better than Book of Sin for what we need to do. No, we don't have a reroll anyway. I mean, we could do... We could do some, like, D6 shenanigans, but I think it's too late for that. We'll just take the champion belt. I don't think you take the skinny odd. I don't think our tier rate gets better than this. Or if it does, not by much, and I don't think we want that because it's going to lower our damage. I think we're just, I think this is the run. This is what we've got. Maximum of 15 cents to donate to the donation machine. Almost, almost definitely not going to be that much. Well, not maximum because we're going to get a little bit more here from Monstro. But um, almost definitely not even going to be 15, though, because we're going to take damage during the fight. Guaranteed. Oh, we didn't get more here. Never mind. That's Monstro, not Greed. He doesn't give you coins, you silly man. But I, I just don't think we have it in us to get this done. We'll see. You know, I'm, I'm not going to phone it in. I'm going to give it my all. I'm not going to throw on purpose. And I'm not going to take a lazy approach or a defeatist attitude here. I just don't think... I don't think we're going to win. But I'm trying is what I'm, what I'm trying to get out. Okay, well... There's a little bit of damage. The problem is not now. The problem is as he gets, uh... He gets stronger and plays faster as we go throughout this, so... And you can tell just by the trouble we're having with these regular coins. It's not gonna be a fun time. Get any coins that have appeared. Stop him from getting them. The actual- actually the horsemen are doing a nice job for us. We took out most of the hearts there. Horsemen is not something I normally like. Uh, but, you know, we're, we're- we have a desperation run here, so... You never know when your back's really against the wall what item's gonna come out of out of the woodwork to, to save you. Sometimes you're pleasantly surprised. Could be the horseman. Maybe I'll have a newfound respect. I doubt it, but maybe I'll just at least remember that they helped me once. I mean, they're doing good. The flies are doing some nasty damage. I can't deny it. Between the blue baby flies and the horseman flies, we did better against regular greed here than I thought. Now the question is, with our trash, like, monstro range, can we handle the dodging and the doing damage in uh, the greedier fight? That's a little bit different animal. Don't, please don't heal again. That's all I ask. Please don't heal again. You son of a bitch. <laughs> you absolute a-hole. Please. Okay, we got him. That feels good. I think there's no reason to wait. I think you, uh, you stomp him as soon as you can. And we actually got this, which is nice. I'm gonna go out of my way to grab it, which is... You know, actually, maybe I shouldn't have, because... It's gonna feed him HP, but it's also gonna feed us donation machine fodder, which is important to me. No! Come on over! Come on over, greedy! Come on over! Come here and try to stomp me. Please. Come ho come over here. Jump over here. There we go. This is our ideal. That's our ideal situation right there. Okay, we've got him pattern locked. I think we can make this work. He's no longer pattern locked. Can you jump down here, please? Thank you. No, no, no. No, no, no. Not like this. 
Come on down. It's gonna be a tight one, dude. Oh! It's gonna be a very close one. Please, okay, when I wanted you to get pattern locked, I didn't want you to go through the pattern this quickly. I don't even know if we're hitting him from down here. Like, we don't have the range. Okay, halfway. We're halfway. I feel like we should be more. But I think we're actually, like, healing him occasionally. Which blows. <laughs> Maybe shouldn't have taken. Okay, we rushed through that, actually, for once, appropriately. We maybe shouldn't have taken, uh, Head of the Keeper, in hindsight. Maybe. Or I'm a genius and we're actually gonna get to donate on this run because we took it. Please get away. Okay. It's fine. Very, very focused, and the commentary suffering as a result, but if we get the win, I'll be happy, happy for it. Let me out. He got too close for my liking. Uh, that was a bad dodge that was rectified at the last second. We're gonna do it. I think we're gonna do it. I did not think we were going to live through this, but we've done it. We've done it. And increased our coin amount all the way from 15 up to 40? <laughs> nice. 0% chance of jamming. Let's see if that holds true. It's going to go up as we donate. Oh, yeah, take it! He's done it. Maggie, greedier, completed against all odds. Gave it a 28. Turned out to be 100 at the end of the day. That's not how statistics work, but we win. Thank you so much for watching. If you enjoyed the video, leave a like or a comment. I exited the game. I'll just talk to a black screen. And if you'd like to see more Binding of Isaac Afterbirth Plus content, and other content when it comes out of the channel, please subscribe. Click the bell if you'd like notifications when a new video goes live. I'm Accidental Grenade, and thank you so much for watching Spooky.